Hi, Lon. Hello, Adam. Thank you so much for inviting me here. It would be great if we could have a look at this innovative blader and a boat design that you've come up with. When people first see it, they really got to be hitting the teeth. Got to give it that wow factor. A bit like your jag there. But the best thing we can do is take you out on open water so you can really feel how she goes. Let's do it. It feels so controllable. I love how your hull design keeps the power boat stable in the water. Well, what we're doing now is we sit on that centre hull and the, the tips of the blades are uh, just holding the craft upright and keeping it gently balanced. So, uh, it definitely works. <laughs> right, Jeremy, should we put the hammer down a bit? Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. You might get wet in the back lawn. <laughs> he loves it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Lorne, that was absolutely unbelievable. It'd be great if we could go back to the workshop and I get a chance to talk to you a little bit about the new Jaguar XC. Lorne, that was an amazing experience in the Blade Runner. The thing I was really impressed with was how stable the boat was at high speed. Well, basically, these blades here give you the stability. In addition, they've given us these tunnels, and the tunnels can provide aerodynamic lift. The biggest challenge is getting these proportions correct in their relationship with each other. But you must have had quite a few challenges on this. The main one, really, I suppose, was it's a lot more difficult to design a car in aluminium than in steel. We work every bit of a millimetre to get it absolutely perfect. Just something I'm really proud of is how closely we work with the engineering teams, the manufacturing teams to have such a, a great interior package. But also what we wanted to achieve was best in class design. And we have this very nice plant on cabin effect, which is very dramatic and very good for aerodynamics as well. And it's just lovely to see your boat design and the car design together. It has got the same feel. And I think uh, if you're a designer, you can feel that flow, can't you? You want it to look as if it's going like a rocket. Every Jaguar we design, whether it's an estate car or a saloon car, they're all sports cars because they're yeah. Jaguars. We always try and make the car look like it's moving when it's standing still, like it means business. Same time tomorrow out on the boat? Absolutely. 